Alright, so I did a video, uh, I don't know, about a week ago, and got some messages asking to see more of the bug mark. So, here it is. This started out as a standard uh, browning bug mark, and uh, let's see, I sent it to long range precision, had them cut the barrel down to four inches because I knew I wanted to uh, suppress it, and I also got them to uh, thread and tap. thread the barrel for my suppressor. I don't know if it's going to zoom in. Anyway, it's threaded. And uh, I got it threaded so it would fit my SWR Spectre. I got a bunch of 22's because they're cheap to shoot. So I figured I might as well. A um, couple things, let's see, it's got the uh, Hogue 1911 grips and uh, this is a uh, 1911 adapter plate made by uh, a guy named Rusty22 he goes by Rusty22 on YouTube and a couple other places uh, rimfirecentral.com some places like that but I got a message um, asking how quiet the buck mark really was and uh, here it is I guess it helps so I keep it in the frame. It's very, very, it's really quiet. I'm shooting uh, uh, this Federal Bolt Pack. Oh, this is with uh, Federal Bolt Pack, Walmart goodness. And it's still uh, very quiet. The dink you're hearing in the background is uh, a shooting box approximately 68 yards back. So that's how quiet it is. You can actually, I mean, you can hear the bullet hit the backstop all day long. Pretty quiet. This is uh, the distance is approximately, uh, I don't know, maybe 18 inches from the uh, actual uh, camera. So it's probably 19 inches from the speaker or the receive the microphone on the camera. Good old federal bulk pack. So that's it. The buck mark suppressed. It's really quiet.